guys, welcome to another week in my life vlog. It's Tuesday afternoon, I'm actually about to head out to get a blowout, I've just been in meetings today. Okay, so anyways, this is what I'm wearing today. I think it's super cute, like I actually love this outfit. These, again, are my Princess Polly favorite current jeans from them right now. I don't remember where these shoes are from, but I can link them. This is a rental piece from Newly. work with them on the podcast, so I don't know where it's from, but I'll try to link something similar. I just think that like this look, like, I feel cool, you know? Anyways, we're actually about to head off. I'm gonna get a blowout tonight. I'm hosting a happy hour for you guys in Dallas. So that is exciting. Subscribe if you guys are new. Okay. Guys, it's starting to feel like fall. Treating myself to a pumpkin cold brew. Also, I got my nails done today. They need to be rounded out, like they're too square. I got a blowout just now with Ali at Voss. To be honest with you, like this is my favorite blowout I've ever gotten, ever. As I'm heading home, we have our Dallas happy hours with the girls I'm hosting um, through the Geneva app. So anyone who lives in Dallas, I basically invited. And I thought like 10 people would RSVP and we got like over 100, which is potentially gonna be a really big problem. We're gonna go to Toller Patio, cause it's anyways, um, Dana's coming in an hour, so is Jess. So I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna clean up my house a little bit. And then we're gonna head over a little bit early just to get a table and see what the space is like. Anyways, I'm really excited about my hair. I have two good hair racks in Dallas. My sister, obviously, which I'll link her below. She's really good with blondes. And then Ali just did my blowout. And I've been home, I've been cleaning, the mop is going. We are heading off to the happy hour. I'm very excited. Oh, Jess is calling. Hello. We got so lucky, no one is here. We are gonna be totally fine. Here. I'm home now and I just unboxed some packages. This one is from the M Jewelers. I just ordered this the other day. I was influenced um, on Instagram. But look at this necklace I got. Call me Chugi. I don't care. I love it. It's definitely a statement. Like it's very much so a statement. But I just think it's so cool. I mean, oh, look at that. It's beautiful. We had such a good time with the Toller Patio. Um, I didn't really push this event that much. I really just posted about it on Instagram stories and on Geneva. So if you're just a YouTube viewer, follow me on Instagram and join our Geneva chat. Even if you guys don't live in Dallas, we do different cities. I just, I know so many people who follow me are like post-grad and so they just moved to new cities and don't know anyone, whatever. So I'm just wanting you guys to befriend each other basically um, and just start doing events and stuff. Bubble BFF. Yes, I will host events in Andrew City. Yes. It was really fun. Anyways, for an event that I really didn't push to, like there was a big turnout, which just means this is a good idea. I'm gonna talk about this once and then stop because I'm sure I've been annoying, but Geneva is like a, it's like a group chat app, but we have a room for books. We have a room for like, we have regional rooms. So for certain cities, we have an FAQ, we have an advice room, we have like so many different things. It's basically like replacing my Facebook group, but it's much, much better than the Facebook group. And it's really fun. So download it, other people have rooms or homes and there's different rooms in them. It's really cool. I will link it below. Hi guys, happy Wednesday. So last night it said it was gonna rain all morning. So I thought I was gonna wake up to rain and then I woke up and it said it wasn't gonna rain till 11. So I called Amanda and I was like, let's walk and get coffee. We were getting ready and then it started raining. So anyways, I think we're actually gonna go get coffee but drive. It is just a gloomy, rainy day and I really wanna have a cozy home day where I film, I'm filming some like sit down YouTube videos, light some candles, make it feel like fall. Like it reminds me of in high school when I would just be so cozy all day and filming YouTube videos and I was like so excited. I'm still very excited, don't worry. Um, I just want like a cozy at home fall filming days. I really, really miss those. But anyways, I'm gonna talk Amanda into going to Tribal is a little bit further away, but I'm driving. She'll still probably control it somehow, so we'll see. You guys also loved Amanda on the last vlog. I'm gonna get the dogs out and then I'm gonna go pick her up and then hopefully we're going to Tribal. This jacket, by the way, I'm not sure where it's from. I got it in my newly package. It says it's from, I'm not sure. It's like $320, I just realized that. But I love it, I'm wearing a size large. I will link it down below for any of you guys, but like, this is such a good fall jacket. I mean, you know, me and Sherpa. Here we are, going to Tribal. Amanda, everyone's favorite person in the vlogs recently. They're hiring, should we get a job? <laughs> yeah, you should. <laughs> <laughs> 
We got our good morning drinks that Amanda now loves after she had a lot of mean things to say. Uh, yeah, because tell them. Show it looks them disgusting. The it looks Let's gross. I have pan to it. I show them every time I'm here. It's, it's like. Okay, do it's do like juice do do with do do. espresso, and I know it sounds disgusting, but it's actually just like really, really, really good. Got a little breakfast burrito, I'm very hungry. Amanda got the migas, which is what I normally get, and then you normally get chips, but they only have tortillas right now. It looks a little bit different than what I normally get. Anyways, very good. Here we are. No, it's just really hard. You don't. Look at what I'm wearing. I love you so much merch. By the way, I know I've mentioned it in vlogs recently. I didn't realize the site was down, so I'm really sorry to everyone who went to buy. Um, it's back up, so I'll link it below. Cute shorts, matching top, a trucker, a mug. It's cute. Anyways, today it's 2 p.m. I got home. Oh, oh, oh god. I got home and I ended up filming two videos. I'm gonna send those over and then I'm gonna start editing my weekend of my life vlog and just like lay in bed. It isn't raining now, but it's supposed to rain tonight. I just want like a gloomy, rainy fall cozy day, but I have a lot of work to do, so I'm just gonna work from bed on my laptop, sue me, but that's kind of my vibe today. So, but it is getting a little bit warmer and it's kind of killing my vibe. What am I doing? I think I just got the stuff, I don't know. Here we go, I'm just making snacks. I have my Better Booch, my favorite kombucha ever. It is so good. If you haven't tried it, I love this stuff. Apple from Sprouts, of course. My favorite place ever. Doing some online shopping. These. Slippers were made for me. They're Ugg slippers. They're like the fuzzy Sherpa look that I love and they're brown I mean, this is a dream come true For my fall boot. I think that I'm gonna get these I'll link both of them below Um, but they just look like something I'll wear literally 24 7. It's currently 6 15 p.m I'm pretty much done editing what I'm gonna edit for the day. I think I'm gonna close. I don't know I still kind of want to work, but I shouldn't I was feeling really anxious, so I took the dogs on a little walk, just a 20 minute walk. I got this new thing, guys. It's one of those um, like LED face masks. I just had it on for 30 minutes as I was editing. Okay, so it does like the different colors. I just did blue for 30 minutes. Blue is supposed to sterilize and diminish inflammation, destroying bacteria, reduces mild to moderate acne, and regulates the oil glands to prevent future breakouts. I want to do like all of the colors though. This was sent to me. It's from Skin, or it's from the Sculpt Skin Bar. I'm actually like really excited. I've wanted one of these for a long time. So yeah, I'm pumped to be using this. Oh, Coco wants to start editing. Guys, I... it rained last night and my window in my closet is broken. So there's not rain in my house. <laughs> Love being a homeowner. Seriously, buy a house, they said. It'll be so fun, they said. Anyways, Amanda and I are gonna go on another walk. We're gonna go to Starbucks. I need to take the dogs out. They have a grooming appointment. I got a lot done yesterday. I just like, I, I don't know. I just was like in my bedroom when I was working, like I was in high school, and I very, I, I understand why that's not conducive or helpful at all, but that's what happened. So anyways, here's my walk outfit. We brought some outdoor voices shorts, which I might regret wearing shorts. It's fine, my full disclosure hoodie. I talked about this in my last video or one of them, but this is like my go-to hoodie. It's my friend Peyton's brand. And then we've got Twin Flames, which is my friend Keaton's brand. Wow. All right. Back here working. I worked out, I showered, I put my hat and my hoodie back on. I'm making some breakfast. Dealing with the house stuff, that is honestly just stressing me out. I have therapy at one. I think someone's coming over, hopefully to look at my wall today. Here's my crazy outfit today. There honestly is like a good amount of reasons to not grow up, but like this is one of the, the top ones. My vacuum's going, the dishwasher is going, I'm waiting for my food. I don't like the clutter up here. I feel like my house is just getting cluttered, even though I keep decluttering. So I need to declutter my kitchen because I just have a bunch of stuff in here that needs to go. Just got a video up. I'm gonna have this organic kombucha. It's apple spice. I got it from Sprouts. I just kind of wanted to try their line. It's like, cheaper than what I normally get. My flowers from McKinsey are unfortunately dead. I'm about to go to therapy, but I have this random surge of motivation to just get things organized today. So I hope that stays. Um, and I'm gonna organize a bit of my kitchen. Like my junk drawer is really just disturbing. And yeah, I don't know. Honestly, guys, I really hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. I never know what you guys want. I feel like I get like no comments or I get comments, but like, no, then I'll meet you guys in person and you guys have so much to say So I never really know what you guys like and don't like or what you want to see 
So, if you're not a commenter, please start commenting because I really need to know. You know? I got someone out today, or I'm getting someone to come out today, and my neighbor um, told me who they use, so I'm gonna see. My realtor, I think, is sending someone to just to get quotes. I wanna get this all fixed as soon as possible, especially with the holidays coming up and it's just gonna be really busy. So, anyways, the dogs still are not done. Like, that's actually been a long time, so. Anyways, we're off to therapy, we go. Okay. Home from therapy, making some soup. I'm on kombucha number two of the day. I didn't love the other one, but this one's pumpkin spice. It's only 3.30, um, but here we are. I'm making some reels and stuff. Taste test. I like it better, but it's not the best kombucha. The chili looks incredible and it smells so good. The morning show is on, getting some work done. All right guys, I just organized my pantry the other week and it's a mess. I have this kind of like Harry Potter closet. The problem is that I don't have like a storage closet in my house at all. So this kind of happens and then things get shoved and whatever. So. I really need to clean some stuff out. So that's what we're gonna do. Dana brought over all this stuff for me to make some drink reels, which will be exciting. I have this delivered. It's a bamboo tray that I'm gonna use to organize my junk drawer, which I'm gonna do right now. Then I also have another hand frother, which I needed for my drinks and mine just break all the time. So we have another one, but I will link it below. It's really cheap. I had one for like a year, never broke. Now they always break. This is really embarrassing and very vulnerable. Here's my junk drawer right now. Here's my before and I'll give you an after. What an improvement. It's not perfect, it's nowhere near it actually, but we're getting somewhere. It looks a lot better than it did, you have to admit. I have a lot of candle lighters, and I have a lot of scissors, which I didn't realize how many I had. This is your sign to clean out your junk drawer. Um, it at least looks a lot better. I'm feeling a lot more put together. Love this for me. Also, here's my 15th of these stupid hand frother things. My gosh. Okay, they just left. It wasn't as expensive as I expected it to be. Where did my stand go? You know what, it's fine. It'll go in here. But it's still just honestly so confusing. I really hate being an adult. I was already just having like an emotionally difficult week and feeling a lot more anxious and then this happened, so not fun. I'm also mainly stressed out because I don't want to have to be out of my house or have my house be messed up during the holidays and also I'm entertaining next weekend and then I. I have guests in town for like two weeks basically. So, you know, inconvenient timing, but it could be worse always, so my dad's calling me. Nighttime now, sorry I haven't vlogged much today, but Fitz is just so cozy. I'm getting my LED face mask on. I just got out of the shower, I'm wearing Skims, and um, I think this is from Revolve. I know I look very scary, guys, but I'm doing my red light therapy. Last night I did the blue light, oh, yeah. but I'm gonna do red, oh my god. Okay, I know this is crazy because I only used it once for 30 minutes, but I definitely noticed so many improvements. I've been talking about how I've been breaking out a little bit recently, which is not even a little bit, probably worse than I really ever have. And I get, a lot of, I get hormonal breakouts anyways, and I definitely should be getting them right now. Anyways, I had some breakouts like around my face, obviously you can't see, but I did have this on last night and it made them all go away or get so much smaller. Blue is for like inflammation, so it definitely helped with that, but anyways. I'm doing red light, I love red light therapy. I'm going to read a new book. I know that you guys are probably gonna be mad that I am talking with this mask on. Like honestly guys, it is really creepy, okay? Okay, it's really, really freaky actually, I'm not gonna lie. But I wanna tell you the two books that I've read this week. I posted them to my Instagram story, but I just thought that they were so good. The first one I read was when She Returned by Lucinda Berry. I loved this book. I thought it was such a unique thriller. It talked about cults, which I'm randomly like really interested in. And it was a really good book. I feel like the ending could have been better. I don't want to spoil anything. I didn't love the ending. I would have wanted something different, but every other part of the book, I really thoroughly enjoyed. And then I read Life's Too Short by Abby Jimenez last night. And it was 
so good. I felt so many emotions as I read it. I read the entire thing in one night. It made me like tear up and I felt so many emotions, like genuinely felt the emotions myself as I read that book. And I just thought it was so good. Such a cute read. It was definitely like heavy, but she has a way of writing about like real life heavy things in a kind of like light and uplifting way. So anyways, I love both of those books. I'm gonna try to read another one because I know that's in the friend zone like series. There's three of them that they go off different storylines. So I think I'm gonna read the friend zone and um, maybe I'll read that whole thing tonight. Who knows? This week I'm trying to just like refuel and recharge. If you guys watched my weekend of my life vlog, I was just getting like kind of anxious. I have a concert next weekend and then we're going to Austin for the Grand Prix for Formula One and we're going to see Billy Joel there, which I'm so excited for. Anyways. And I have some guests coming to town. I cannot take myself seriously. I'm literally so sorry. So I'm trying to just really take it easy and relax and spend a lot of time by myself to kind of refuel, re, I was gonna say refuel and recharge at the same time. To refuel in the meantime because I know that I'm gonna need it soon. So tomorrow's Friday night and I think I'm just gonna stay home. Our normal dinner is not happening tomorrow, I think. So I'm hoping I just stay home and have a really like kind of cozy, easy weekend. I feel like I've been in the same spot vlogging. Don't worry, we are leaving my house today. Just got back from my morning walk. I'm wearing Sun Active, my Lulu bag, I'll link below. I got Starbucks this morning. I've been walking to Starbucks. Not a good habit to have. I also just want to say, skin update, I went back to using my Curology and just Curology. Like, I was kind of mixing up my skincare routine, but I just, nothing does better for my skin than my Curology routine does. So. I've been using that for the past two days and I did my, obviously my mask again last night and my skin looks so much better in the time that it should be the worst. Just saying, it's working. Like, you can see all of it's kind of going down. Anyways, I'm listening to Token CEO, it's one of my favorite podcasts. I need to get some work done probably the next hour and then I have to, I have a Pilates class at 11.30 and I need to stop at North Park on the way, so. And then we have a Mind Crosby kind of event with a few other brands, I'm not sure. It's at Highland Park Village, very exciting. Just sent so many emails to the podcast. I'm on my like second or third token CEO episode today. This is my, I'm going to Pilates and North Park and getting my brows done. I kept the tank on, it was a little bit cold, so I put these leggings on. This jacket, I don't know where it's from, I got it in my newly subscription. I love the clothes I got in my newly subscription. Set, Amazon, Lulu. Got me my keys. Okay, also guys, I just checked this jacket is from Free People. I'm about to go into North Park and get my new boots that I ordered. I'm confused because I was charged, but I didn't get an email and I'm supposed to pick them up. So I'm just gonna go and hope for the best. Just picked up my boots. They were here, thankfully. They are so beautiful. They're pretty popular this season. I've seen a few of my friends even get them this week. I think we literally got them on the same day. I'm just not picking mine up. They're rain boots, but they're really cool. They also have one that's like brown and black on the toe, which I love, but I just got black because this is a staple. They're definitely a little bit pricier, but honestly, like well worth it. I just think that they're so cool. They they go up to your knee. I just, I don't know, I love them. I thought they were great. I will be wearing them non-stop. I will link them below for you guys. I think they're a really great investment piece for like the fall and winter, even spring, honestly. All right, here's my outfit. I have this top on, this blazer, I think it's Princess Polly. These pants are like literally Amazon. I have my new boots on. And we are heading off. We're going to Highland Park Village for a Mayan Cosby and like a few other brands event. I'm not exactly sure what it is. We made it to the village. Your outfit's very cute, by the way. Thank Give you. a little OOTD. We're doing fall. We um, are. This is, oh my God, I think this is H&M last it's, year. Oh my God, we love H&M Zara, fall. Love Zara jeans. Cute. High top love this. <laughs> Okay guys, we're at Starbucks, we just left the event. Getting another Starbucks, I know guys. Alright, so you got my drink. I need a napkin, hold on. Maybe I can just, I, I think I'll be okay. Wow, a genius. Oh wow. They were just trying to give me as much as possible, how kind of them. We went to the event, it was great. Didn't want to pull up my big vlog camera because it was a very small area. Okay, but I just wanted to get coffee again, I know, but Guys, who remembers when Dom and I went to this anthropology every year? I get a text from Dom at least three times a week saying that she wishes that we can go to anthropology right now. So clearly we're both, you know, still down bad, but it's okay. Love this place. Makes me so happy. <gasps> Christmas. Oh my God. No. Oh, wait. These are so cute. 
I have some already, but they're so, oh my god, they're so cute. I'm already shopping for Christmas. They're having a candle sale, so I'm gonna get this one. Technically, yes, it's Christmas, but who cares? And then this is the vanilla. I mean, what? <laughs> this is just a volcano candle, um, but it's white. They're on sale, so I feel justified. Okay, I'm home with my new candle. You guys are gonna die at the afternoon that I've had. Six on a Friday night and I'm already in my pajamas. I just self-tanned. But I have to tell you guys what happened because it is just not my day. It really isn't. So my trash goes out today. It's the same day every single week. And for some reason, I forgot. I've never forgotten. But conveniently, it's the time that my trash is the most overflowing. So I get home and I realize that. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm on the phone with Dom. And I'm like, I can't believe I forgot. I never forget whatever. I come upstairs and Fitz had an accident, which is so rare, but I realized that I was in such a rush. I totally forgot to take him out, it was my fault, which I, again, never do. Like, I'm so regimented with them, like, so structured that it's just so out of character. Then, as I'm talking about this to Dom, I get the candle out and I break it. Let me show it to you. Okay, guys, my brand new volcano candle like, you've actually got to be kidding me. Don't worry, I'm not going to leave this burning unattended. It's fine. But this is my brand new $30 candle that I just purchased. At least it was on sale. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Tico Texas, as I'm listening to the podcast with her, just commented on my Instagram. Uh, um, I, I feel very cool. Anyways. I am experiencing FOMO, staying home on a Friday night, but I also really need it. And I'm really not, like... I just, I don't want to leave. I don't have the energy for that. It's a Friday night. I just wanted Chinese food. I'm staying home. Like I'll save money because I'm not going out and drinks are expensive. So anyways, I got Chinese food. I have my fire going. I'm going to go upstairs and read. Candle is still going. Going to have to blow it out pretty soon. Did a lot of dishes and just cleaned up the place. I'm going to eat my Chinese food, read, and go to bed. So I'll see you guys. Happy Saturday. I'm on my way to pick up Jess. We're going to the farmer's market. I'm wearing this cute vest from Urban that again was my newly subscription. I've, I got a great package from them when I got back. It's, it's like a clothing subscription service. Love the stuff that I got. Thank you. Got my coffee. Jess, isn't, Jess already had some, so I had to pick some up. We came all the way out here just to show Coop the big world that he lives in. We needed to have him experience the farmer's market. I haven't been to the farmer's market in like almost a year. Really? Yeah, Dom and I went through a phase. I really like it here though, it's so cute. Actually, not a year, but maybe Coop wants to go vintage shopping with us. It depends on his vibe. Anyways, we're at the Dallas farmer's market. It's a great farmer's market. All the pumpkins, Texas flags everywhere. Just looking at this makes me feel healthy. Guys, I'm actually having a mental breakdown because there's no bone broth right now. Oh, that's really cute. Look at the little cake. <laughs> but there's no bone broth right now. I don't know where my bone broth friend went. She's nowhere to be found. I should have gotten her Instagram or something. I'm very sad these days. Maybe um, it'll be back next week. Maybe. This is the outfit today, by the way, guys. We went to Lowe's this morning. Um, Coop had a great time. He loves Lowe's, just he like me. Lowe's. His favorite person. <laughs> guys, we're going Vincent shopping. We're going to the Grand Prix next weekend, and I have this like vision of some sort of cool outerwear. Um, so we she need to go here. Copying me because I already bought a vintage jacket. You know, I don't know that you did that, but sure, I'm, I'm copying you by going to the Grand Prix. That's for sure. So, anyways, we're off. We made it to Bishop Arts. We had a successful trip. I'll show you guys a haul when I get back. We're back. Surprise, surprise! Outside of Tribal, it's Jess's first time in Bishop Arts. Yeah, I what really do you think? Like it. Cute. She's only seen about one corner. You haven't even seen the other places. They're oh. so cute. Yeah, cute. We're gonna go to Dolly on Python and maybe another place, but probably just that place. So. Got the beautiful oatmeal from Tribal. It's so good. Whew, okay. All right, guys, haul time. The first thing I got is a stylus pen. I have purchased probably, oh, fits, no. Those are plants. I cannot tell you how many Apple pens I've purchased and lost and they're pricey. So I wanna see if this one is like comparable because I'm tired of replacing them. From the vintage store, I got this Carhartt jacket. I just feel like it's gonna be such a great fall staple and something I'll wear a ton. Then I got this for my little brother. My family, are, they're just huge Steelers fans, the vintage Steelers jacket, which I think is really cool. And this is kind of his style, like he's into this stuff. So I thought he would like it. He sounds excited. 
And then I got these Levi shorts. I really wanted denim shorts that are loose around my thigh, and these aren't loose, but they still fit well, so I think I'm gonna cut them a little bit shorter. Um, and then wear these with my new boots and like a sweater honestly probably tonight I'm going to dinner with some friends I also came back to a package from Year of Ours, which is my favorite fitness brand um, I'm wearing Year of Ours like leggings literally right now. This is um, something from them that I've never had before What is this? Okay, so the star legging and mauve, but like first off your butt's gonna look incredible I cannot describe to you how soft this fabric is Wow, I mean it is just like, it's so soft, I'm obsessed with it. So we have those leggings and then we have this top, which the top kind of looks a little bit big. So hopefully it fits the medium. I'm normally a medium in tops, but we'll see. Um, I just thought that was really cute. It's also a little bit more coverage, so wearing this like a jacket or something in the fall. Then, I love these because I love the color. I think these are the football leggings, is that what they're called? Yeah, the rib football leggings. So their rib leggings are incredible. This cut is great, and then like this, the football legging, I think they're cute. I love the color. And I also got this matching bra with it, which I think is really cute. So that'll be really good for Pilates, I'm excited. I love the Pilates class that I did yesterday. I went to Shine Pilates, I think I talked about that in the vlog. I've been kind of off my vlogging game this week, but um, I went to Adam and it was like my favorite class I've taken in Dallas so far for Pilates as far as music too. Like we have a problem in Dallas where people play 2012 top 40 and it like makes me want to die. Like I want rap music in my workout classes and he killed it. Then I also just have this nice long sleeve workout top which is the cut out long sleeve charcoal top. So. I just got a bunch of stuff in for my costume with someone else. We have a surprise visitor coming soon. Comment below who you think it is. And comment below what you think I'm being for Halloween. I'm actually really excited for this. I either hate Halloween or I have really good uh, like costumes planned out far in advance and I ordered them on like October 1st. So I'm really excited. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I have really exciting videos coming out that I'm filming and I'm really excited, obviously. So I love you guys so much. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you soon. Bye! And what's funny about the guy with navy sheets is that you know that the guy with navy sheets only has them because his mom bought them for him. Yeah. Because they know as a mother that their son is not going to wash their sheets that often. Mm -hmm. And you can't see dirt on navy sheets.